night, the FBI returned to the laundry home looking for clues about where Brian might be hiding. Two agents you see there went into the home just after 1 o'clock this afternoon. Then they searched a camper parked in the driveway. NBC2 Samantha Servant is live at the home with what the agents might be looking for. The FBI showed up here and spent about 30 minutes both inside and outside the laundry family home. Their attorney tells me that they were looking for more of Brian's personal belongings. Take a look and you can see the FBI inside the laundry family camper. Then they leave with more of Brian's stuff, but they aren't the only ones looking for him. The Peace River Canine Search and Rescue Team is on a mission. Well, the process of search is a lot, of, a lot like the process of elimination. Knowing where he's not also helps us figure out where he is. They're teaming up with Dwayne Chapman to find 23-year-old Brian Laundrie. Yesterday, they spent all day on the water near Fort DeSoto, where Brian and his parents camped this month. Well, for us, because our dogs are trained to work from the boat, they will uh, we'll circle around the islands on the downwind side. Uh, the smaller islands and if there's human odor in there the dogs will bark and let us know there's something going on then we'll pull in and we'll run the dogs through the island and see what we can find the dogs gave alerts at two islands where at one they found a campsite kayak marks and open drink containers uh, some of the uh, cans and stuff that we found drink cans were collected and i guess a dog will turn those over for fingerprints and stuff so we'll see if any of that leads back to Brian. The team is taking the day off today while going through more than 1,500 tips. Tips are key in missing persons cases, according to Callahan Walsh from the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. That little piece of information that you're holding may be the key that unlocks the door to justice. He believes the attention on the Gabby Petito and Brian Laundry mystery may help bring resolve to other missing persons cases across the country. We've seen way too many of these long-term recoveries to ever give up hope. The FBI is still looking for tips from anyone who may have information on Brian Laundry's whereabouts. There is more than $100,000 worth of reward money for anyone who has those details. Live in Northport, Samantha Serban, NBC2.